what I've been doing to set the stage is going around the country hi highlighting locations where there's nuclear waste throughout this country and just uh, making the statement that it is in the national interest and actually it's national federal law that this waste be consolidated in a centralized storage facility. And so with that, uh, I, I'll begin. Uh, today we're headed to uh, the great state of Minnesota and we're looking at a nuclear power plant called Prairie Island. Prairie Island has waste stored above the ground in pools and dry casts. Prairie Island is in the Mississippi River floodplain, as you can see from the photo here. And Prairie Island is 50 miles from the Twin Cities. Now, where should this waste be? Well, this waste should be where in the 1982 Energy Policy, um, the Waste Policy Act, uh, and then the amendments in 87 said by federal law it should be, which is in, underneath a mountain in a desert. And where is that mountain? The mountain's called Yucca Mountain. Currently, after $15 billion spent researching and preparing the site, we have zero nuclear waste on site. Uh, if we were storing the nuclear waste there, it would be 1,000 feet underground. It would be 1,000 feet above the water table. And it would be 100 miles from the nearest body of water, which would be the Colorado River. Now, look at the difference between Yucca Mountain, 100 miles from the Colorado River, versus nuclear waste right next to the Mississippi River, actually in the Mississippi River floodplain. So why aren't we doing what the law has dictated? Well, uh, we have the majority leader of the Senate who's been blocking funding and stopping any movement to do the final scientific study. In fact, the will of the House was spoke uh, last year when we voted, I think, 297 votes, bipartisan votes, to complete the, the funding and the, and, the, and the study. So let's look at the senators from the region of where this nuclear power plant is. And it's very curious, the two uh, senators from Minnesota, uh, Senator Klobuchar, Senator Franken, they're silent. They're silent on nuclear waste in their own state. It's, it's very curious. Not only nuclear waste, but nuclear waste on the river. And then you go to North Dakota, Senator Conrad has voted no. Senator Hovind supports it. South Dakota, Senator Johnson voted no. This is all in the region. Now Minnesota has two sites, three reactors. Two of them are right in this location. So as I've been coming down to the floor, if you add these new centers to, to the uh, total tally, right now we have 40 senators who have expressed support for moving high-level nuclear waste. We have 12 who are curiously silent on nuclear waste in their state or in their region. And we have 10 who have stated a position of no. It's in the best interest of our country uh, for the safety and security of this country that we consolidate in a centralized location underneath a mountain in a desert in the defined spot by law, which is Yucca Mountain. And again, I want to thank my colleagues and, and friends from uh, Pennsylvania for allowing me to intrude upon their hour. And I yield back the balance of my time.